Peter Dagger. I'm the CEO of Evil Geniuses, and we are here in Alameda, California at the Xfinity Training Facility. Break their shield. Can we get Zarya? This weekend, we have our brand new Overwatch team here. We use this weekend to bring them out, introduce them, kind of teach them what it is to be EG, and give them an opportunity to get to know each other on a personal level and have a lot of fun. Let's meet the guys. I'm Eli Gallagher, otherwise known as Elk or Elkia on the team. I'm the uh, in-game leader and shot caller. So I try to make sure everybody's happy, everybody's where they need to be. Back up decap, back up decap. Back up to choke right now. Yeah, I'm very talkative, I'm very hypey. I like making all the players feel like what they're doing is good when they make a good play. Good shit. Okay, so I played StarCraft II a lot. I played League of Legends a lot. And most of the time I found that since I played on a laptop, I could not win mechanically. I, I just could not outskill somebody else because I was at a disadvantage at almost every turn. I made it to high diamond in League. I couldn't climb anymore because it was just playing League of Legends at 40 frames per second at 90 ping is, is not easy. Uh, so I kind of just took to out metaing whatever I was against. I did research. I made sure I knew what they were good against, what they were bad against. I made sure I knew what my opponent played. I made sure I knew how they played, what their KDA was, how aggressive they like to be. Do they get first blood most games? How passive do I need to be? So I just, I like the macro style. Let's outplay our opponent. Let's be better than them. So my name is Justin Ha. My in-game name is Kayun, And I'm most commonly known as the, the Genji one trick on the team. A lot of people don't know that I used to play a lot of hit scan. So when I hop off that Genji, I can play the Zarya, I can play the Tracer, I can play the Soldier. I used to play Widowmaker a lot too, and people just don't know that they think I'm just a Genji one trick. A lot of my friends just know me as that guy that did well in school and just plays video games as a side kind of thing. So <laughs> I really want to see their expressions once once they see me on the big screen. It's, just, it's insane, I can't actually believe that I'm right here. It's crazy. Uh, my name is Lucas Nettesheim. I play as Flex on the team. Tracer's point, Tracer's point. Keeps just does his own thing. Um, the only thing I really have to worry about him is making sure that he's still alive, because he's really quiet. And I just go, every once in a while in Discord, I just go, hey Peeps, are you still there? And Peeps would like do his squeak, telling me that he's alive. What if you could say anything to all the people watching this video? and all of your new incoming fans, um, you know, what do you want to say to them? Hello. Can I, can I get a little more? Like, uh, you know, thanks for, <laughs> thanks for supporting me. Uh, you know, come watch our team. Oh, uh, uh, yes. Hey. <laughs> okay, okay, it's fine. It's done, that's good. Let's go again. It's done, that's good. Let's go get pizza. Let's go get pizza. <laughs> My name's Corey Nigra. I play Hitscan for the team. Hitscan suits me because I have lots of experience in other FPS type games. So transferring into Overwatch from playing Counter-Strike makes it fairly easier to do my job. I'm a tall dude, I'm 6'3", and my arms are very long. So playing like, as like a traditional keyboard in front of your monitor doesn't like feel right for me. So it's all the way in the back. I push my monitor to my face and I'm gonna go blind in like three years, but it's okay. I saw Eastwind playing in a tournament and they absolutely blew everyone away. So I saw a distortion spot and I knew who distortion was. So I thought I could just like... If you're watching this distortion, please don't come to my house, you're huge. My name is Anthony Goliath Pietro and I am the flex support player for Team Evil Geniuses. And my job is essentially to keep my teammates alive while also negating any threats that are in our way. The characters I usually play are Anna on defense, and if you usually were on attack, I'll play Zenyatta. And then on rare occasions, I'll even flex to other players like Sombra or even Tracer at times. As soon as Overwatch came out and I started playing, the more I played and climbed through the ranks, I started thinking to myself, dang, if I'm getting top 20, top 10 in the nation, this might actually be a potential career path for me. So I started doing a little research into esports and once Blizzard announced the Overwatch League that was coming later on, I sort of started to think that I could really do this. I have the time, I'm at community college, I have the determination and I thought that if I just go for it, that 
it, who knows what would happen. And at, that, at this point in my life, if I didn't take the risk, I would regret it forever because this is a once in a lifetime opportunity and it reaches a point in your life when you can't maintain the reaction times or any of the requirements of being a professional video gamer. And so I told myself that this was a risk that I had to take essentially. Oh, three, two, one. Let's go! Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! What do we want to go. do on defense? Make sure that when you try to sleep him, he doesn't hook you. My name is John Nguyen. I am the player manager, coach, and analyst of EG. My most important job is basically making sure that the players are ready for their matches and just try to make it run as smoothly as possible so that they're ready for their game. You don't need a Zarya for their comp. Zarya is shit. The recruitment process for us is not like any other esports crew. I made sure that each player that we picked up went through like a very rigorous trial process. It wasn't they played with us for two days and we signed them the next day. It's more like they play with us for two months and then we'll think about it. So the team and John wanted me to let you know that you're, uh, I'm going to be sending you over a contract later this week. So no you're officially way. on the squad. <laughs> oh my god, no way. So how do you feel, man? Tell me. Honestly? <laughs> I'm lost for words. So we've had this team house here for, I think, like almost four years now, and it's kind of been our home base. We almost consider it like our office, since we don't really have any established headquarters. Uh, we've had dozens of players in and out of this house over the years, and we've used it um, especially for training for upcoming major tournaments. And like this weekend, we had these guys playing in an online cup with some of Xfinity's best internet. I walked in the door and saw the computers and had never actually been in the same room with a, like, with a desktop that could run Overwatch at that many frames. It was just so exciting. Coming to the gaming house, I think, was like the coolest part so far. Walk walking in and seeing everything that's here was the coolest experience. It's definitely a lot better than I expected. So at first I thought, you know, it'd be really awkward meeting your teammates for the first time, seeing their faces and interacting. But it wasn't like that at all. Our entire team was just, you know, so energetic. It just felt to me like it just a bunch of friends hanging out, playing video games, and just being good at it. Sitting next to each other is such an improvement. Like, we improved more in these past couple days than I think we would have in weeks. Being able to have the reassurance that no one's mad after the game and, like, being able to sit down and talk through what, what went wrong was just so much nicer. It's, it's amazing to be here. Oh, dude, it gets me going when, when my entire team is just hyped to play a round and we win a match against a team that we were always having difficulties against. That energy in the room after that win is just, it makes me feel good. And it still feels very surreal to be here. Like, I was a kid watching, like, Evil Geniuses play League of Legends. It's incredible. We're aiming to be the best team in North America. And I think that our journey there will be very interesting, very cool to watch. We're a very good team and can put up good results. And uh, I think it's only going to get better from here.